Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Vipul Gupta. I hope you guys are doing great and enjoying this SQL interview preparation series. So guys, today I am back with another interview problem. This problem has been part of Meta's data engineer interview. And in this video, we are going to discuss the step-by-step -step approach to the solution. But before proceeding further, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you do not miss any update regarding my upcoming videos. So guys, let's get started. So guys, the title of this problem statement is spam post. And in the problem statement, it is mentioned over here that we need to calculate the percentage of spam post in all viewed posts by day. That is, with respect to a particular day or a date, we need to find out the percentage of total spam post with respect to the total viewed post, right? Now further, it is mentioned that a post is considered a spam if a string spam is inside the keywords of the post. That is, in the post keyword, if spam keyword is mentioned, then the post is considered to be a spam post. Now further, note that the Facebook posts table store all the posts posted by users. That is, this first table has all the data for all the posted posts right now the facebook post views table is an action table denoting if a user has viewed a post right so the below table that is facebook post views is the table which contains the details of the posts which are viewed right so now based on this problem statement let me make some notes and we'll be referring those notes while writing the final query so the first point is we need to in the select statement we need to print the date right and the percentage of spam posts with respect to the total viewed posts right now in the problem statement there is no specific filter has been mentioned but it has been mentioned that we need to calculate the percentage of spam post in all viewed posts only right and also it is mentioned that this first table has all the posted posts and the below table has the viewed post data only. That is, in order to play with this viewed post only, we need to take an inner join of these two tables. right? And the joining key would be post ID in the first table and the post ID in the second table. right? And the below table has the viewed post data only. That is, in order to play with this viewed post only, we need to take an inner join of these two tables right and the joining key would be post id in the first table and the post id in the second table right so now first of all let's write a basic select statement by applying the inner join for these two tables all right so i will be writing select a dot so i will be giving alias a to the first table that is facebook post and alias b to this facebook post views table right so i will be writing a dot star comma b dot star from Facebook underscore posts a inner join Facebook post view table and the alias will be B. now the joining condition would be on a dot post id equals to b dot post id right now let's execute this part to see the output all right. So guys, here what we are getting, we are getting only the details corresponding to the post which have been viewed, right? Now, let's take a look at the output table, all right? So we are getting post ID, the poster. So basically poster is a person who has posted a particular post, right? Now this column has the post text. Now further, this column has the keywords, right? Then we have the date. Then post ID is repetitive because it is common in both the tables. Then we have the viewer ID. All right. So guys, now let's move ahead and refer the pointer that we have mentioned over here. Right. So the first column that we want to print is the date. Right. So date here is representing the date of posting. That is the post date, which we can take from the table A. Right. Now moving ahead, we want to find out the percentage of spam post with respect to the total viewed post. All right. So guys, let's do some mathematics over here. So in order to find out the percentage of spam post, what do we want to do? We want to take the count of 
spam post right and after that we need to divide it with the total viewed post right so count of total viewed posts all right so this will give us the percentage and then we need to multiply it by 100 obviously right now this date part can be taken from this column now for this count of spam post what we can do right so here it is mentioned in the problem statement that post is considered a spam if string spam is inside the keywords of the post right so we need to refer this column post underscore keywords and we need to find out the post in which this keyword spam has been mentioned right and in order to count the total viewed post we can take the count of all the post because by applying this join we already have filtered out only those post which have been viewed by the users all right so now in order to count the spam post what we can do so we can write a case statement that is if in a particular post keyword if we have this spam keyword then it will be considered as a spam post right so i will be writing here that case when a dot post keyword now i will i want to compare a string so i will be writing like right percentage spam percentage so now why percentage spam percentage so now in order to count the spam post what we can do so we can write a case statement that is if in a particular post keyword if we have this spam keyword then it will be considered as a spam post right so i will be writing here that case when a dot post keyword now i will i want to compare a string so i will be writing like right percentage spam percentage so guys what we are doing in this case statement is we are checking this particular column post keywords and we are checking whether spam is mentioned in the post keyword right and we are using percentage because percentage operator is for n number of characters so for example in this case we have these two characters before spam and these two characters after spam so percentage sign will take care of these things right so guys now case when so if this column has this keyword spam what we are going to print then we are going to print one else we are going to print none right and as spam post right now let's execute this part to see what we are getting all right so guys what we have done till now is we have printed all the columns from both the tables as well as we have created an additional column by the name spam underscore post which is showing whether a post is a spam post or not right now you can take a look at the output here so we have these columns from the table a and table b and additionally we have created this spam underscore post so if a particular post is a spam post so we have printed one against that right and if a post is not a spam post so it is printing null right so now let's go to the pointer that we have written so here we have written that in order to find the percentage of spam post we need to take the count of spam post right so now in order to take the count of spam post what we can do we can simply uh, count this column right and in order to count the total viewed post we can take a count star right so guys here what we can do we can put this part in either in a subquery or we can use a cte cte stands for common table expression and then we can refer it to create the final output table right so here i will be using cte so let me use with cte right as so now i am putting this part in a cte all right now i will be referring this cte as a virtual table and i will be writing my final query right so now in the final query i want to print the post date so i will be using select post underscore date right 
Now after that I want to find the percentage of spam post and in order to find out the percentage of spam post we need to take the count of spam post divided by count of total viewed post right so I will be using count and spam underscore post right so it will give me the total count of spam post on with respect to a particular date right now multiply by 100 and then I want to divide it with respect to the total viewed post. So I will be using count star right from CTE. Now, since I am counting, I am taking this as a count right with respect to post date. So I will be using group by. So we, either we can mention one or we can mention post underscore date. So I will be using post group by one right. So let's execute this to see the output. Uh, first of all, let me give it an alias as percentage spam posts. Right. So, guys, now let's execute this final query to see the output. Uh, we are getting some error. It's duplicate column name post ID. All right. So, guys, we are getting an error. The error is occurring because in the first table we have one post id column and in the second table we have a post id column which is leading to this duplicate column name error so uh, since we do not need post id in uh, our query and we don't need viewer id as well so what we can do we can either uh, remove this b dot star right so guys uh, i have removed the b dot star column because we do not want the, these two columns post id is in the first table and viewer, viewer id is something which we have not used anywhere so we can simply remove it so now let's execute it again to see the output all right so guys this is the output that is desired so corresponding to two days we are getting the percentage of spam post right so corresponding to this first january 2019 we have 100 percent of the post which are spam right that is if 10 posts have been viewed by the users so all of those 10 posts are spam post similarly corresponding to this second row that is 2nd january 2019 we are getting 50 percent that is half of the post which have been viewed are spam post right so guys this way we can attempt this kind of problem now let me give you a recap of what we have done right so now in this problem what we have done first of all it is mentioned that the first table has all the post data whereas the second table has the viewed post data right and as per the problems asked we need to play with the viewed post only so for that first of all what we have done we have taken an inner join so now by applying the inner join we have selected the post which have been viewed right now further we have used this case statement by applying this case statement what we have done we are creating an additional column by the name spam underscore post now this column is giving us one or null depending on if this particular column post keyword has this spam keyword right so based on this we are creating an additional column right and after that we are putting all this in a ct we can also use subquery and we are then referring these this table or this ct to find out the final output right and in the final select statement we are printing the post date because we want to take this percentage of spam post with respect to the date right so we are printing post date and then we are taking the count of spam post multiplying by 100 because we want to find out the percentage and we are dividing it with respect to the total count of viewed post on that particular day right and since we want all this aggregation with respect to post date therefore we are using group by one this one is corresponding to this column that is post underscore date right so as thank you for watching this video i hope you like this also in case of any doubt or any query you can let me know in the comment section below also you can reach out to me for any question or any other problem at my gmail linkedin instagram and all the details are mentioned in the below description section right so guys if you like this video do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe my youtube channel analytics with Bipul for more videos like this in the next video till then happy learning